Oh, no. Sailors and Marines pay tribute to one of their own this afternoon, joining family and friends at MCAS Miramar for memorial service honoring Lieutenant Nathan Pelosky. It's been two weeks since he was killed in a middle air collision during a training exercise as the USS Carl Vincent made its way towards the Middle East. Fox 5's Ashley Jacobs takes us inside the emotional service. It's the sound no parent ever wants to hear because a 21-gun salute means a service member is gone. Lieutenant Nathan Pulaski's family says he died doing what he loved and lived each day he had to its fullest. He did. I mean, I lived through him. Like, as, as a young girl with him, I went to the air shows and I had a, you know, just a passion for the flying and so when he got to do it it was almost like I was getting to live a childhood dream that I would never fulfill and so he lived his dream. He was warm and smart, funny, he loved life, he lived it to the fullest and um, the outpouring of support and love has meant uh, an enormous amount to his family. Speaking at this memorial service wasn't easy for Jacqueline Clements. For the last two weeks I've, you know, thought about him, thought about our memories, stories, just everything. But when it came time to write... It all became a blur because I felt like I had so much to say and I didn't know, you know, where to start. So she started at the beginning. Nate was my baby brother, but I looked up to him like my big brother. And now she holds on to her baby brother in a new way, keeping him close to her heart with a new necklace. It's actually made a real big difference in the last uh, week um, wearing it. I just, it's something that makes me feel connected to him because I don't have anything else right now. The 26-year-old Navy pilot clearly made an impression on everyone he met. Hundreds of people wiped away tears. He said he was going to chest bump the president smiled at the sight of Nathan's smile and together looked to the sky, remembering the loved one they lost. Ashley Jacobs, Fox 5.